Today we're going to say bye to these raggedy fox seats and hello to the SN95 seats. Here we go. So here is the bracketry and motors and stuff for the seat. Um, the guy did tell me he was having trouble getting the seat out because of something. Um, I did not realize until just now that he actually broke the mounting. See that right there? It's supposed to have one over here. Yeah, he broke that off. That's a so he didn't even say anything. But for ten dollars a seat, I still can't complain. So you know what? I'm gonna take these tracks off, and I'm gonna switch them over for the Fox Body tracks, and we shall uh, get these seats installed and working. So first things first is gotta take these bolts out. So just to show you all, these are the metal wires and supports that support the bottom. This is what the bottom of the Fox seats look like. So basically when I sit down, I go as far as this cushion will go, which is pretty much all the way to the floor. So with these sliders, because they're mounted in here, you have to um, drop them all the way down, take out the bolts, then raise them all the way up and take out the other bolts. So these brackets came straight off of this raggedy Fox Buddy seat bolted right to this SN95 seat so I don't have all them heavy motors and everything it's just a mechanical seat I do still have you know electric switch there and there but that doesn't matter to me this is not a show car um, this will probably get a seat cover over it. thinking about removing the uh, seat belt bracket here um, I think that's gonna get in the way more than it's gonna help anything so I'll probably just remove that and it'll make it easier for putting a seat cover over it too like I said only little blemish in the seat is this hole right here and that's a pretty simple fix i mean anybody that can stitch can stitch that up or put a patch over it it don't need to be perfect this is mad max you know on this side these are still intact um on the passenger side there's none of this is electric i can switch this bracket it's the same pretty much as this bracket so this will bolt into place so again, no modifications needed. If I was gonna keep the electric tracks, I wouldn't even need modifications on that side, but these are the same. So I'm just gonna bolt this side in, I'm not switching out tracks. All right, guys, there they are. This one's still a little wet. I uh, found that out when I sat in it, but it'll dry out. But man, that looks so much better. Grays actually match up pretty good. Um, it's not perfect, but again, I don't know why I keep saying it, but nothing on this car is perfect. Do want to get some floor mats, and uh, yeah, everything's good. So, door shuts. We're good to go. Well, seats clean up pretty good. They uh, feel way better than them raggedy old fox seats with a cracked pleather that stabbed me when I got in and uh, falling through to the floor. Hoping I can find a cloth back seat. I would love to just go with cloth interior. Um, I find it easier to deal with and then in the summer it's not so daggum hot. I'm in Florida, it gets over 100 degrees regularly. So to step into leather that'll, uh, it'll literally take the hide off of you. So short little video of uh, something else done to the car. Hope y'all enjoy. This is Horseplay, peace.